Hey friends, it's Len here from 1A Auto. Today we're going to be working on our 2006 Toyota 4Runner, and I want to show you how to remove and install a sun visor. So we're just going to get right into it. You got your sun visor here. You'll notice that you have a mounting screw right here, and then one that's a little bit easier from the other side, right there. They're both Phillips heads. You're going to use the same tool, just a simple Phillips head screwdriver. I'm going to remove one screw here. That screw out of there. That's what it looks like. Set that aside. You'll notice I still have the sun visor clipped in up here. That's just so it's holding it for me. I only have two hands, not three, so it just makes it easier. Let's see if that one's coming out. Screw number two. Grab the visor. There it is. Let's do a quick product comparison for you. Right here's the original, obviously. Here's our brand new quality 1A auto part. As you can tell, they're both the exact same. Got the same stickers and everything, except for maybe this one right here. I don't know, maybe you could draw a pretty picture there if you wanted to. We'll leave that up to you. Anyway, the 1A auto part has the mirror slot as well, which is very nice. With all that said, I don't see any reason why I wouldn't want to install it into the vehicle, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it. So we're just gonna take it, put it into the clip up here, that's going to be helpful because it's going to make it so I don't have to hold on to it. Both hands here. Get one screw ready. Get that one started. We're not going to fully tighten it down yet. Do the same to this one. Just going to turn that a little bit. All right, both of these are started. We're just going to snug it right up. All right, let's test it. Up, down, that feels great. Give it a little swing. Awesome. Uh, oh, yeah, mirror works. Cool, that looks great. Easy peasy, thanks for checking in. Thanks for watching. Visit 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts shipped to your door, the place for DIY auto repair. And if you enjoyed this video, please click the subscribe button.